Oh my God, look at that. That is just nasty. What's up guys, it's Brian again from Lake Hickory Scuba and Marina. If you are new to our channel, do me a huge favor. Click this little subscribe button right here and ding that little bell as well. That way you guys will be notified every time we upload new content. Now in the last two days, we have been doing a ton of salvage work. Whether it's search and recovery or salvage, we have been slammed busy. We just lifted a 43 foot houseboat and we have been answering house calls left and right for cell phones, sunglasses, wallets, keys, you name it, we've been going out searching for it. But today is the day that I'm actually gonna break my gear down and clean it. And when I broke my mask down, look what I found inside my mask. And if you've never seen a mask broke down, there's several components. As I take the skirt out here, you'll see it's literally nothing more than a silicone skirt with a plastic frame. You have your lenses, and then you'll have a uh, clip system or a mount system that goes over and locks it all into place. And the way a mask works is this ring here actually goes inside the frame and then it's secured by the lens to hold it in place. And then the top part kind of clips on and it locks it all together and makes a waterproof seal. But I want to show you just how nasty. Now, guys, this is actually my mask. This is not a customer's mask. This is my mask. And look just how grimy and nasty it is. Now, I do clean my gear every single time I go diving, whether it's in a swimming pool, a lake, or even a quarry or the ocean. But where the frame mounts, you can see kind of where this lip right here sits up inside here. It just collects grime and just pure nastiness. And if you don't break your mask down and clean it, it's not going to be very healthy for you. This could actually be black mold. Now, I'm going to clean this off, and I hope it's not. If it is, I'm just going to trash it and buy a new mask. But I hope I can get all this cleaned off. But this is something that you should be concerned with. You should actually be cleaning your mask. I would say about once a month, you need to break it down into the individual components if you can and clean it. If you can't, take it to your local service center and let them clean it for you. But guys, I hope you find this <laughs> kind of entertaining, but also educational as well. I hope you understand just how important it is. To be honest with you, even if I do get this kind of cleaned up, I'll probably trash the mask anyways because I can't believe I've been breathing or using this mask with this much gunk and grime in it over say the last year or so but i'm gonna finish cleaning this up and see if we can get it all cleaned up but if you did like this video give me a big thumbs up definitely share it as well and get out there and clean your mask guys as always make sure you follow us on instagram and twitter like us on facebook pin us on pinterest subscribe to us here on youtube and as always guys we appreciate your business